the season is proudly presented by Muddy, serious gear for serious hunters. Hey, on this episode, we're going to follow along with the White family. I just love these guys. Like, you know, Kayla and Avery are always getting it done. Now, wait a minute and, here. <laughs> Wes is getting it done, too. Yeah. We can't count him out. <laughs> on, this, on this show, all three of them get in on the action during the Wisconsin gun season. Well, it's opening day here in southern Wisconsin rifle season. Um, we're on one one of our properties, uh, an old made box blind that I have here, and we're overlooking just a big alfalfa field. Um, unfortunately, when I purchased this property, it was under alfalfa and it was too late to, to do corner beans, so um, there will definitely be some grain in here next year for the deer, but for this year we got hay and alfalfa. So Avery's up to bat. I'm just looking for, you know, Nice two and a half or a three and a half year old buck. Um, got some pretty far shooting here, so if it's too far, you know, we'll, we'll just let it go. Or if it's big enough, maybe I got a tag too, maybe I'll shoot. So uh, we dropped Kayla off back at the beginning of the property and she walked up to a box blind up on this ridge. So um, there was some deer in the field when we got here and she kicked a deer up on the way in. So there's definitely deer moving and uh, just stick it out and see what we see. Stay tuned. It is November 20th, opening day of rifle season in Wisconsin. We're hunting a brand new property this year, so we haven't been able to spend a lot of time on it and really get to know the lay of the land and how the deer behave on the property, but it's a beautiful day today. Wes and I said, here on this property, different blind, this morning, and we saw three doe. Uh, but from what we're seeing, we think that this property is more of an afternoon, night hunting layout. So Avery and Wes are in a different spot. We split up to double our odds. So I'm in this blind by myself, and I kicked out a doe on my way up the steep hill to get to this blind. So I'm hoping that means that there's more to come here tonight. So hoping to at least see some activity and at least start to learn more about the property.
Own the Season is brought to you by Walker Spirit Protection, Cold Steel Knives, Wild Game Innovations, Hawk, Hunter Specialties, Tenzin, Ameristep, Cyclops Light, New Archery Product, and Scent Slammer. We just bought this year. Here, look at the camera. Um, and we we're fortunate enough, we just hired our first deer. Avery made a great shot of 250 yards. And a uh, heck of a buck. Congratulations, honey. I love you. <laughs> Give him a minute here and we'll go get him. I don't even know what to say. Um, just insane. I was sitting here, we were watching Avery's deer go down, and I looked up and there was a nice buck with like six or seven doe. And he was walking out here, there's three minutes left of shooting light. So we uh, we put it on him, got it all on film. That's the first time I've ever doubled gun hunting. And me and her just got it done in five minutes. And mom's still hunting. And mom's still hunting, so. incredible we're gonna we're gonna keep it a little secret with Kayla I just heard two shots I'm thinking it has to be Wes or Avery who are hunting not far down in the field the same property again so I'm not very good at judging distance from the shots that I've heard um, sporadically all afternoon all evening but it sounded pretty darn close so I'm anxiously awaiting to see if one of them two had success, there's only about one minute left of hunting time, so we will have to see. Wow, that's incredible. We're gonna, we're gonna keep 
keeping a little secret with Kayla. We're gonna tell her we got one, of course, but um, not that both. Of us. Yeah, not that not that both of us got one. So, what a great night! Awesome. Yes. Well, we got out of the blind and we went back and we got Kayla. Uh, she had to walk down off the ridge, <clears throat> and it's gotten dark now. But uh, there's there's no track job needed. Uh, we watched watched him go down in the field. So um, he's just right here. We have to use the headlights, unfortunately, from the car. But uh, we're gonna walk up and get him. Nine pointer. Nice job, Avery. What a great buck. Um, I really didn't know, you know, what she had shot. Um, I didn't know if he was at eight, a nine. Um, it, it just it doesn't matter with us. She has a good time, and we just had we had a fantastic hunt. It'll be one to remember uh, for a very long time. But uh, once again, this this is really our first rifle hunt, new property that me and Caleb purchased this year, and you couldn't ask for better of a night. So um, we're gonna get him home, and we got a little surprise yet here. So stay tuned. Well, we uh, we just went and found Avery's buck, and uh, we got it taken care of. We got it loaded up, and now it's time to come and find mine. Um, we didn't tell Kayla right away that we both shot one, but uh, it worked. Uh, we've been playing tricks on Kayla for years, so. Uh, I did shoot one, it went down the field as you saw, so there's no track job. Once again, we have no lights, so I'm just gonna use the headlights here and walk up. He's laying right here. The ten pointer. Well, he's, he's what I thought he was. You know, I knew that he was 18, 19 inches wide. Um, ten pointer. A little short tines, but looks like an older deer. Um, looks like he's got a wound here on his back. But yeah, just a great buck. Just the biggest thing was, uh, you know, with Avery shooting hers and we had we had like six minutes left, maybe seven minutes when she shot hers. But when I shot mine, by the time I saw this group of deer that came out, I only had like three, four minutes. So it was just a hurry up rush deal. And me and Avery both shot bucks the same night out of the same blind, same gun, all on video. Yep. Congratulations. Thank you. Make a Love you. Thank you. Oh, we got eyes on a buck out here. We're gonna close the gap. It's definitely not, not within my range to shoot, so we gotta get ourselves up here quite a ways. We gotta belly crawl about 100 yards. This season is brought to you by Skull Hooker. Hunting made easy. 
True Glow, Birchwood Casey, Avian X, Vortex Optics, Eastern Archery, Arctic Shield, and these fine sponsors. morning we watched the footage and knew that it wasn't a very good hit that I had on that deer so we just gave it the night it's plenty cold it's down to 18 degrees I think so plenty cold we just had a not very good night's sleep but it came back out here this morning and we're just gonna track the blood and see what we can find hope for a little bit of luck little bit of luck did us some good so unfortunately not a great shot on my part um, I think it's over 300 yards 350 something like that so definitely a poke for me but no excuses um, like I said a little bit of luck never hurt I'll take it but definitely I don't think I've ever had a deer with brow tines like this so um, we had not seen this deer before though so just the luck of the rifle season didn't have pictures or scouting of this buck, but I'm definitely happy to add them to my collection. So, great rifle season. Congratulations. Thank you. Well guys, what another exciting rifle season here in southern Wisconsin for us. Um, this property was interesting when we first walked into it. There was no food plots, uh, there was no grain, uh, corn, beans, anything like that. So. All the things that I was used to hunting over the years was not there. Um, there was a big alfalfa field that was having some deer come to it, as you can see. Uh, so we just went into the center of it. We put a homemade box blind that me and Avery sat in the first night. And luckily, we saw probably eight or nine deer. Uh, the two bucks that we harvested were first to show up, and Avery made a great shot. And then, obviously, you can tell I made a couple great shots, too. What was your favorite part? Um, I just got, I enjoy getting excited, getting emotional and happy, and I enjoy spending time with my dad hunting, and I get excited when my dad gets excited when we get a deer or see a deer and I can possibly get a shot at it. He helps me get the gun, and I just get really happy. Which that's what practice is all about. Um, you know, we practice all year, and just you have to be ready for that moment so Avery's been a trooper all along she doesn't always want to go to the gun range or doesn't always want to go put up trail cameras but that's what it takes so it's all part of the process and then shortly after their hunt I had my opportunity to fill my gun tag um, just Wes and I went out on that hunt and that was a, a super fun super fast but a unique and fun hunt for me 
Um, their hunt, they pulled their usual trickery, uh, their dad-daughter duo, trickery on mom. Um, so the Avery's very first year hunting, they had told me that she shot a doe, which I was super excited for her, and come to find out she had actually shot her very first buck. Um, turkey season, they came home and told me they came home empty-handed. Come to find out there was a turkey in the back of the truck, and now the rifle season, they pulled another fast one on me. Again, I was super excited in the moment, thinking that just one of them had filled the tag, and then come to find out they had pulled their first double out of um, a blind for rifle hunting. So they're always up to no good, but always having fun, and that's what we're all about as a family. She almost knew there was two shots she had heard, <laughs> but... Uh... She just, she wasn't quite sure, so she didn't give us the benefit of the doubt. She they're becoming, it was us, but... They're becoming very good fibbers yeah. over the years, so maybe next time I'll learn my lesson. So I hope you guys enjoyed the show, and uh, hopefully we'll see you guys in the spring turkey hunting and next fall in the deer woods. Thanks. Those captioning is brought to you by Stealth Cam, the leader in trail camera technology. Hey, if you like what you see, be sure to check us out on social media. Yeah, you know what I'm doing right now, you know? Snapgram, Face Chat, Instabook, Twitter Box, you know, all those cool things on the interweb. Those aren't things. Go to Art Helen Outdoors and Own the Season and like, share, and follow us on all your favorite social media outlets for the latest content.